Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. Somebody traced this and they sent it to me and they have this line across. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take and see how big it is. It is almost 10 inches. I'm gonna set my nudge factor on 12 and I'm gonna make a duplicate. I'm gonna make another one. He's saying that the virtual segment delete key will not work in this case. On my Corel, it works. But let's say that doesn't work. Well, you know what? Let's back up here. Maybe I shouldn't have been able to, I mean, I just opened this. So let's group it together, Control-G. Let's see if that's the problem. Virtual segment delete key. Nope, still works. So if yours does not work, there's two ways you could do this. If we look at the curve on one layer, we can go to object and break the curve apart. And then you could click on that line and delete it. Or even better still, if that doesn't work, you could, and I do this a lot, manually remove that line with the shape shape tool, just click on that node and hit delete. Click on that, try to get that line and hit delete. So it deleted that whole line because you you selected it. Now the for the one I'm doing it for, it won't really matter the way it's uh, working, but you've got a, uh, I call that a whoop de doo And really the only way to get rid of it is to select them both, right click and turn them into a line. But in this case, it doesn't really matter because there's a bunch of them. Now, I also noticed in the one I'm doing it for, you have some black line. And because we've broken it apart, and once again, my delete tool is not working for some reason. There it goes. So, and then you're gonna have to take your smart fill tool, set on black, actually zoom in, and fill that in with black. Now there's two areas that did not fill in, which is right there and right there. Now that's, this is a pretty rough graphic, but maybe that's the way he wants it. I mean, it's it's a pretty bad file. It's pretty, uh, pretty fuzzy. I mean, you can barely tell that there's a, well, you can tell a belt and maybe I wouldn't do anything. And I'm actually gonna make a second video if you look at the text, it's a solid line with a outline. And what we have here is a bunch of lines. So if you take and use a smart fill tool to fill that in and that in, you get, you've gotten some uh, weird lines and weird shapes. So I'm gonna make a second video on how I would clean that up. Anyway, hope that helped. Thank you for watching.